back to my channel so today we are going to be doing the set that was just on the screen so i have french white and we're going to do two coats on two of the nails and then i got this gorgeous new color called smarty pants 267 and i'm going to do two coats on the other three nails and then we're going to go in with matte top coat on top of the two white ones because we're going to get out this lovely pink marble ink and there is just acetone in my dabbing dish and we are going to do a quick ink marble this is just a quick video today i love doing designs like this i, I love using the marble inks and um, you can get them from the wow wow website they have two different sets they have this set which is just the marble inks and then you have the metallic marble inks and don't forget you can get 10% off using my code BeckyWB10. So I just go in with a little bit of acetone, make that marble how I like it, and then if I need to add more, I will add more. And you don't need to cure these, these just air dry. So once I've done that, I've got the gold liner from the rainbow set, and I'm gonna continue doing sort of marbly lines just to add some sparkle to these nails. So I'll let you watch me do this. Oh, there's a trick. Uh, these are good for like learning line work. So I like to go and I'll show you on this one. So I go in really, really light and then I push down. See that there? And then you can practice your pressure with your brushes. Because you can actually get really quite thin lines with these, the brushes that you get in the liners. So now this is another one of my new colours, it's called Pink Gum, it's number 14 and it's such a bright pink, I love it. So I'm going to do an ombre, so I've got my ombre brush, I've put some base coat onto my palette and I'm loading my ombre brush up with base coat and then taking the excess off. And then every time you see me going off screen here, I am cleaning my brush. So the trick to this one is keeping your brush, blush, your brush as flat as you can. And if you need to add more base coat to your brush, you can just remember to take that excess base coat off because you don't want to add base coat to the nail. You're just using it to help with the blend. And that's, well, I didn't really show you it really well there, but I'll show you it later on. That was your ombre done. So pop that in the lamp on this nail, which will be the pinky. I am just doing a pink French. So I just draw my line when I want my French and then fill in the end and I'll just let you watch. So I'm going to go in with a matte base, uh, matte base, a matte top coat and go over the ombre, the purple nail and we will do the French but I'm going to do a gold line on this one first. So I've just got the rainbow gold liner out again. Um, this one is slightly more glittery than the original set. Um, absolutely stunning though. And then I'm going to go in with a shiny top coat. Um, on the two marble nails and then the French again with the matte. Then I decided that we we're going to use the champagne wow crystals and I just do three on the French, three on the ombre and on the plain purple one we'll go in with a big cuff around the cuticle and then I add two nail, uh, two nails, two crystals and like a row down from that I'm really really bad at explaining anyway and then a kite I'll show you in a minute you'll see exactly what I mean so there's two 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 there and then the kite see there you go <laughs> and then at the end I just go over those ones that we've just put crystals on with a matte top coat and this is the finished set um I hope you like them and Oh, I've got some exciting news coming soon, so hopefully I'll get a new video out next week, and I'll see you in the next one.